problems right now. That should be going live in a minute. But it. Um, I'm going to go for about 45 minutes. Going to do a lot of small ones and one big one as much as I can. Um, tomorrow will hopefully be a big long stream. People ask me that. She's fine. Nothing serious. We had brain surgery a couple years ago and there was a follow up thing. We just and it's going to be a very quick stream tonight. I will probably not be doing any of yours tonight, but tomorrow it's going to be a nice long stream. This is just me trying to catch up on a few things. Since, you know, crap happened. I had a couple rush orders come in that are for gifts. Uh, music kid, let's start. Canvas. Get going pretty quick. I actually have to find where I put the blue. I use them very often. Bad luck. Take two seconds and do it while everyone's. Surprise, surprise. I didn't get my stuff organized with everything going on. <laughs> I'm doing the Raven Club one first and then looking for that after. Uh, no preference? Cool. Uh, hey, Twig, glad you could make it. Um, yeah, tonight's going to be a bit of a weirder stream. I'm only going for about 40 minutes at this point. Um, crap happened. You follow my Facebook page, you probably saw. <laughs> cool. Yeah, let's go Ravenclaw first. Funny you guys are uh, having heat issues right now. It's actually like beautiful here. Perfect temperature for painting. Next frame I could. If so, please remind me. I'll make sure I do it now. I feel like we talked about something and it's just been a bit of a hectic couple days and I'm probably forgotten. And yep, yeah, Amanda, I am going to be doing that one tonight. Don't worry. That is on the top of my list. For anyone looking for that one, I actually can see a little bit of my Facebook because it's coming through my, page, my phone this time. Yeah, anyone watching on the Facebook page, I can't really... Yeah, that's the first one. I think I finally got the colors to look just about right on this screen. Not perfect, but way better than what they had been. The blues are never much of an issue, I guess. Uh, okay. 
How's the uh, stream quality, by the way, guys? The internet is really cutting out out here today. It was freaking freezing cold. It made it really hard to paint continuously. Let me check the comments. Make sure to. Yes. Uh, yeah. It. Unless someone says otherwise, with the little ones, I usually go more portrait than landscape. Yeah, that is portrait orientation. Last time, but okay. <laughs> okay, I'm going to look for Gizmo real quick. I'm going to take two seconds to try to find Gizmo. Um, Megan, if you can answer me real quick, or music kid, if you can answer me real quick, um, will it make a big difference if it's made tonight or tomorrow? Because I know Gizmo is here somewhere, but he's in one of the sections that I haven't organized yet, and I'm planning on organizing that before the stream tomorrow. And some. Bubble tea? Yes. Fantastic. Love it. Music kid, you're good? Cool. All right. Thank you. I appreciate that. Uh, okay, let me find Falcor then. That's another one I don't have on hand right now. Uh, this is what happens with the ones that I don't use very often. I kind of get thrown into a jumbled pile. Yeah, I haven't for a while. My wife and I just rewatched it since, or I just watched it for the first time since it's on uh, Disney Plus now. Promise I will get back to painting momentarily. Categorized, and I tend to order all my stencils by category, and Falcor is kind of off on his own somewhere. No, no. Alright guys, we will keep going. They need to jump to something else and do that one off stream. Looking to find Falcor, so I can do both of those in a row. Okay, I'm going to have to do something different with that. Uh, no clue where my software was. 
Okay, a little something different. But I will do my gizmo run now. Sorry guys. There's a gizmo. Look at that light. Trying to keep it from glaring too heavily. Okay, one more quick look for Falcor. Otherwise, I'm just going to do them by hand. Which I can do. I just don't very often. I don't know why I don't have him. I very rarely use that stencil. It should be practically brand new wherever it is. Okay. Uh, yes, Twig. Um, so yesterday I was supposed to do a big long stream that got canceled because my wife needed an MRI in Halifax. And we just got back like 10 minutes before I started streaming tonight. Um, so what I'm going to do is tomorrow I'm going to do a nice long stream, three or four hours long, probably starting sometime in the afternoon. Um, either starting around 4 o'clock or 6 o'clock, kind of depends. Uh, but it'll be a nice long one. Okay. Uh, there's never any story. I'm going to take one more quick look for Falcor, see if he shows up somewhere. I'm going to find him as soon as this stream is done. I know I am. No, 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 no. More of me wishing I had already organized them. Logic for where these are. Realizing I don't really have a lot of logic for where these are. Oh, 
there. Not there. There are actually only so many places that I could have put that. It's going to end up being in like the weirdest possible place it could have been whenever I actually find this thing. It'll be at the bottom of a pile of Digimon somewhere. I probably lost Enough wasted time I'm looking for it. Let's just do this thing back. Not with that one.
Hey, music kid, you get it. Yeah, I, I didn't want to put him in the Swamp of Sadness, but it's probably one of the most iconic scenes from that uh, movie. Now I need a good image of Falcor. Pull up my phone. Amanda, I see that you sent me messages. I won't to read them for one sec. I will check before I'm done the painting just in case you want me to change something. Alright, give me a good image of Falcor flying in the background. There we go. There we go. I wish you guys could get better detail on that. It looks really freaking good here. Add a little more white to him.
There we go. All right, let me check that message. Make sure I'm not missing anything in this one. Yeah, yeah, and the end of this one is yours. This is a little combination of everything in that. Had popcorn in the background, had Trey up front with the horse and the small of sadness. Had the, uh, the Empress's uh, uh, Palace in the background. Again, I grew up with this, with the movies and with the, the show and everything. Hmm. One sec, guys. I'm a nerd. <laughs> cool. All right. So I managed to go with this one. And we'll move on to another one. Uh, never ending story is kind of a complicated thing if you never if you didn't grow up with it. It's um it would take a while to explain. <laughs> Someone else wants to give it a try, go right ahead. Uh, I'm gonna see what else I can do tonight. Okay, I didn't have any I have one more that was a super pressing one. It's gonna be one of my big uh, um Anyway, if you're watching, this one's for you. Uh, it's a big Avengers one, but with uh, Loki added in and on the dark. You guys have seen me do this one a few times now. But, um, but it's Alright, let's make some room. Discworld, Discworld. I remember that and I don't, I can't remember why. This one will probably be the last one of the night, guys. I wasn't planning on doing a long stream tonight, but tomorrow I'm going to do a three or four hour stream and try to clear up what I've got for orders right now. Maybe not everything, but I still need to cut some more stencils. I've, uh, uh, the last day or so has been pretty uh, hectic. I'm not getting the stuff done that I was planning to, but, you know, things happen. And if we hadn't run and done that MRI now, it probably would have been another year before they would have been able to get her in, so... Not regretting that. <laughs>
And all these stencils now. And very carefully pry them apart because this is a high stencil painting and I'm using glow in the dark on them, which sticks more than normal spray paint. This might take me a sec. But it probably makes sense to clean all these right now, so I'm going to use oh, 20 freaking stencils on this one painting. Okay. 
Almost there, guys. <laughs> These three, and they are very much stuck together.
Guys, one sec. I'm gonna need a new can to go in the dark. <laughs> Brenda, I haven't actually watched Discovery yet. I'm a big Star Trek fan, but I just I heard so many bad things about it. It hasn't. It's been on my radar, but I've had way more things I wanted to watch first. And that's gone. Loki a little here. Thank you. 
All right. That one's finally done. Now this is a glow-in-the-dark one, so if you guys stick around for just one sec, I'll show you what it looks like. Oh, I forgot to take these ones off. Separate those because they've been really doing a lot of paint on them. I'm going to hit the lights and we'll see how this goes. Okay. I'm give it a minute to charge up first. I don't know if I can actually reach over there. And yeah, Danny, if you're watching, this one's yours. And for everyone new, glow in the dark is not magic. What I am doing right here is using a UV light to supercharge it. Essentially, if you leave this stuff in a dark room, it's never going to glow. It needs either natural light for a certain amount of time of day or artificial light. Um, the UV I use just basically supercharges it really quickly so that you guys can see it on stream. If you have a black light, go right to town and it'll glow, make it glow really quick. And the, uh, the reds like that don't show up and glow in the dark. It's all going to be that kind of coloring. I'm sorry if you can't see it very well. Glow in the dark does not pick up well on a camera no matter what. Okay. Yeah, turned out okay. Looks way better in person. It's a more of a bright green and actually like glows rather than just being a faded color like you guys see, but turned out okay. All right, guys, uh, that is going to be the last one of the night. Um, I'm sorry it's a short stream tonight. I will be back tomorrow, either starting at 4 or 6, depending on how my day goes. And I'm going to do a three- or four-hour stream and basically try to get the early orders I have, except for a couple that I need to make new stencils for. Thanks for sticking with me, guys. Oh, uh, music kid, you had a question. How many cans of glow in the dark have I gone through? So far, probably about five or six. Um, I go through it faster than any other color. Because um, you need a one, because I can't see what I'm doing with it, so I overspray with it just to make sure. But also, it needs a lot of glow in the dark paint in order to glow the way it does, like in order to like make it pop out more when it does. Um, stuff is super freaking expensive, which is why I have a premium on it. Like, which is why when you order a glow in the dark one, it's going to cost X amount extra depending on the size. Um, but it looks really freaking cool. And as long as I can keep having, as long as I know people are going to keep wanting it, I'll be able to build up a supply of it so it's not going to be a thing about waiting for it anymore. Thanks, Alex. I'll, I'll see you on stream tomorrow, I hope. Oh, I'm a joker. Yeah. Hi, right, guys. Have a good one. Oh, uh... Uh, Twig, actually, if you look back, uh... I was probably back in November, but I did one, um, and it's it's kind of a cross between a couple things, but it looks freaking cool. If you want it more like actual like Western sunset kind of thing, I can do that no problem. I did more like space, like it's Star Wars, like I did more like greens, blues, planets, like that kind of thing, um, and with Baby Yoda in it too. But like it looks really freaking cool. All right, guys, I'm gonna put this one away. Um, but yeah, 